Hi everyone, I'm Joe and this is my daughter Ellie. Today we're going to take a look at Alarma Zoco Linea Mini. This is how the Mini came in, well packaged and well boxed up. Let's open it up. What impressed me right off the bat was the Linea's accessory kit. And as you can see in here, Ellie's going to open it up for us real fast. And you can see that it came in with a little welcome home card, a quick start guide, the manual, which is pretty nice to have, and then of course all the other accessories that come, which is pretty impressive. A nice little, uh, a little pitcher, steam pitcher, a uh, good Larma Zoco porter filter, and what I really like is these testing kits. These are pretty neat to check your water and make sure that you have the proper water because that is absolutely critical when it comes to making an espresso. Now you may be asking, is this machine worth the price? And I will tell you it absolutely is. One of the ways you can check is the consistency of the pour and how many shots you can actually get out of this machine before it begins to lose any type of pressure. I'll give you the spoiler right now. It doesn't lose pressure. The steam is incredible on this thing and you can consistently pull shots until the reservoir is empty of water. Okay, so now we're gonna fill the reservoir with water. And of course, you gotta remove all the tags and I really highly recommend that you read the manual first because it tells you the instructions to set it up. But Ellie's just gonna show you, what you how simple it is to fill the reservoir with water. It can be plumbed or you can actually just use the reservoir which is what we are currently planning to do. Another thing that I failed to mention was that the machine is just, it's just remarkably made. The steel on this thing is awesome. The thing weighed about 90 pounds shipping. Uh, it is a, definitely a sturdy machine. And I can't say anything more as far as the quality of it being made. And we're going to open up the top so you can see what it looks like inside. But I'm sure these are things that other videos will show you. So for now, we're done with the water. We're going to power it up and make sure that the boilers get filled out. And we're going to get ready to start. Okay, the machine is now set up. And right now what I'm checking is I'm checking for pressure. The pressure at the group head is at 12 bars, which is perfect. And the pressure over at the uh, steam is hovering between 1.5 and 2, which again is perfect. My indicator lights are on. Blue means that there's water in the reservoir. And the red light means it's ready to go. So let's move on to the next step. And oh, by the way, I forgot to mention, I love these porta filters. So when you look at these porta filters, the standard Larma Zoco porta filters, right now we're going to be using a 14 gram and Ellie will start po uh, filling her shots here. All right, now Ellie's gonna get some coffee into the porta filter. We've adjusted our grinder uh, to make sure that we've got the proper grind. And uh, our water, we've also checked our water. Larma Zoco does a great job sending us these little kits to make sure that we have the proper water. I also recommend going over to Chris Coffee. They also can help you with regards to getting a least expensive uh, water filter system for your, uh, for your sink, for under the sink. Uh, the folks over at Pacific Espresso are the folks that actually helped us out with getting this Larma Zoco Linea. Uh, and the alarm and the Mazur Mini that you see in the background that Ellie's working on right now. So we'll get this uh, we'll get this coffee puck ready here in a second. Okay, I think we're ready to go here. So we're gonna start. Uh, we're gonna start our timer here for how many seconds, Ellie? Between 26 and 28. Let's see what happens. Good. We got a nice little mouse tail coming out of there, Ellie. Good job. Good extraction. A little fast right now, but hey, we'll see what happens. All right, here we go. All right, let's take a look at what these things look like. Okay. Yep, we should let it trip. There we go. All right, let's take a look at these and take a look how it, how they came out. Hmm, not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, so Ellie's going to rapidly make some more sets of coffee here for us. So she'll use her knock box and make sure that we get the coffee out. And what we're going to do is we're going to try to get six coffees brewed rather rapidly. And we'll see how they come out. Okay, so Ellie the Bean, she's already poured uh, six shots of coffee, as you can see. So now we're going to take a look at our steam wand here and see how much pressure this thing is. It's pretty darn amazing. So... I open it up, as you can see, I'm going to actually open it up just so you can see how much power is actually behind that thing. It's amazing. Going to take that puppy out, just make sure I get it here real fast. 
and just my pitcher filled with halfway white water with uh, milk. And it is certainly powerful. Ooh, it's hot, 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 hot. All right, there we go. Take that out. All right. Ellie, do the honors. And here we go. And this machine's a pretty powerful machine. I'll tell you, if there's any reason why it's definitely worth the price, do these, honey. That's just my espresso shot. I'm trying to run away. If it's worth uh, any reason why it's worth the price, it's the quality of the machine. This thing's going to last, I mean, forever. Uh, you could just tell it's just exceptional quality, well built. The power in these boilers, which is, again, not an uncommon thing for La Marzocco. They managed to get this thing. Uh, in such a compact size at a 110 capacity, which is pretty neat. Um, the other thing I would probably tell you that you can consistently make shots. Again, we just made six espressos and there's absolutely no change, uh, little change in the pressure. And there's Ellie, she's just at her thing right now. And again, I can't wait to have my shot of coffee for today. So, hey guys, that's our short video. There's plenty of videos out there that actually tell you how to actually pull a good shot as far as the water quality, as far as grind, as far as how to do latte art. But if you've got any questions about this machine, give me a buzz. Uh, just shoot me an email and uh, I'll be glad to answer any questions. It's a fantastic machine, well worth the price. And this is Joe and this is Ellie signing off. Great hot chocolate. <laughs> Joy. Delicious. Delicious. Say wave hi. Say wave bye bye. bye.